COVID affects people with inflammatory bowel disease? Well, that, understandably, is the question being asked by every patient being treated for IBD at the moment. And that's why gastroenterologists at the Royal Devon and Exeter Hospital have launched the Clarity Study, an urgent nationwide research study into the possible side effects of the pandemic. If you are one of the 500,000 people being treated in the UK for IBD, then those researchers need your help. Inflammatory bowel disease, Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis affects almost one in a hundred people. And not just them, but their loved ones too. Then last year, COVID raised a whole range of new concerns. Are IBD patients more vulnerable to COVID? Will IBD drugs make the new COVID vaccines less effective and put IBD patients at greater risk? The Clarity Research Project was launched in October to answer these and other big questions. This research could have a profound impact on the lives of thousands of people with IBD all across the UK. Having gathered and analysed your data, for example, your doctor could change the way they prescribe your drugs. The Clarity IBD study is led from Exeter, but it wouldn't be possible without the support of 92 gastroenterologists, one at each of the participating sites, and more than 500 research nurses. This has allowed us to recruit 7,000 patients in just three months. This is the fastest ever recruiting study in inflammatory bowel disease. The inflammatory bowel disease itself is, is difficult enough to contend with. COVID on top is very, very scary. The Clarity study is very important because it could affect our future treatment and it could affect, well, whether we live or die ultimately. If um, by being part of this study helps other people remain healthy for their children, then I'm all for doing it. The study involves completion of a questionnaire by the patient every eight weeks, and we send a link out electronically to their smartphone or by email. And in addition to the questionnaire, patients will also be asked to give an additional blood sample. We we were very mindful when we were designing Clarity that this was a study we wanted to deliver nationally and in a time where uh, we have a pandemic going on. We think that patients and uh, people with inflammatory bowel disease know their disease better than anyone else. And so we've designed the study where most of the information comes from directly from the patients. The last one I did, I was having my infusion um, and it was no longer than about seven, eight minutes. So the key messages for participants in Clarity IBD are please keep with the study, keep answering the questionnaires that we send to you, please keep having your blood tests, and please let us know when you've been vaccinated via the questionnaire uh, that we're sending out to you. Even if you stop treatment, even if you switch treatments, please stay in the study. Well, I'm going to stick with it because I can see the benefit. We have to look to the future. We have to think about what's coming our way and any tool we have to help us is really important. Stick with it, see it through to the end, let's get the data, give them every piece of information they could possibly need. And the more people that ha who have this, this disease that do that, the better. A big thank you to all the hospitals and patients taking part in this study. It really couldn't happen without you.